Hey there, my name's Robbie and this is Ariana. And welcome back to our channel. <laughs> Yes, we're in Liverpool, Manchester Street, the home place of the Beatles. And we're about to give you some proper Liverpool loving. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. <laughs> so today, you guys, I'm off to Liverpool because I'm finally, finally going to give you a tour of Liverpool. By the way, the message you just saw before it was worth was Zara's beautiful daughter, Aliana. Oh my God, like the train, we're going to miss the train. It's the train. A bit of drama in the vlog is always good. <laughs> How are you feeling? Well, uh, Smart cat piss. Dirty. So we made it to Liverpool because I know that I already showed you a, a different part of Liverpool in a previous video. Do so you want to watch that video? Go and watch it now. But now we're going to go for a coffee somewhere. So like this building here basically guys is the city hall. This is where all the big decisions about Liverpool are made. Wow. If there's basically one thing that I really like about this city, it's probably actually the architecture. So yeah, so guys, the, the theory is that the people of Liverpool are supposed to be the friendliest in the UK. Are you guys friendly? Where are you from? Entry. Entry. And are you friendly? Yes. Are they the yeah. friendliest in the UK? Yeah. Yeah. Are you from Liverpool? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> are you really? No. <laughs> Shop's cool. Yeah. I mean, I don't think you're very mean. <laughs> Thanks. Quite friendly. <laughs> yeah. Cheers. Bye. Bye. Ciao. See you later. Bye. But now we're going to go for a coffee somewhere. <laughs> I'm not sure if you can hear me because it's like super windy, but right now we're at St. George's Hall, which is probably one of the grandest and most beautiful, most beautiful buildings of Liverpool. St. George's Hall is now used as a wedding venue, I think, but in the past it was used as a... Uh... Okay, so as you guys can see, it is an amazing building, like super big, super big. Now I think we can go to the Walker Art Gallery, I reckon it's pretty cool for you guys to see. Um, yeah, it's pretty big. I don't actually know if I'm allowed to film in the gallery. I don't really see why not, but... I'm not really sure if you recognise this guy, you guys, but he's pretty famous in British history. Do you know who he is? Henry the First. Okay, guys, so we're in the uh, war park. Can you watch your name? Sorry? My name's Jo. Jo, Joanne. Um, and I just asked Joanne whether she thought the Liverpool people are the most friendliest in the world, and she said no. Definitely Manchester. Do you think Liverpool people are the most friendliest in the world? Yes, they are. Yeah, I think you also be friends, so she must be right. Don't you think? <laughs> cool. Thank you. Thank you so much. Liverpool people are definitely super, super friendly, guys. Super friendly. If you know me well, you'll know that I literally am obsessed with libraries. Like, I literally love libraries so much, and I think that the Liverpool Library is probably one of the best libraries in the whole of the UK. It's super beautiful. It could be really boring for you guys, so I'm going to literally run into the library, go around the library like, really quickly, uh, I won't bore you guys obviously with the details, but I literally am obsessed with British libraries. They're so cool, they're so good, um, and we should be really proud of our libraries. So, yeah, here's the Liverpool Library. So basically this lovely lady here at the reception of the Liverpool Library um, is so not friendly, she's an absolute... I'm joking, no, but yeah. So do you, do you think that Liverpool people are super friendly? Absolutely, the friendliest in, in the, the UK, in the world. In the world, no, without a doubt. That's a pretty big statement to me. Well, it's the truth. Are you from Liverpool? I certainly am. Where about? Uh, Walton. Walton. Oh, okay. So we must trust her. Um, yeah, so she's a bit camera shy, but anyway, she's super lovely, super friendly. So yeah, let's continue. Thank you so much. Steve, so you're going to ask me a question like, what What do I actually like? What libraries? Well, I don't know. I don't really know. Honestly, I couldn't tell you what it is, but I'm literally obsessed 
like since I since I was a kid, kind of like I used to come to the library and just research everything. We're going to take the lift now to the top floor of the library and hopefully try and get the view. Because the last time that I came here, it was shut. It's the perfect opportunity to show you my outfit of the day. I've got my jacket from Zara, my top from Schlesinger, my ASOS bright pink top, obviously my ASOS jeans that make my bum look gorgeous. And yeah, my new balance trainers, outfit of the day. They're friendlier than London, right? Yeah. <laughs> they are, though. No. You're tricky. Uh, memory card's full, and my battery's about to die, so. By the way, Liverpool Library, how amazing. Yeah. Okay, guys, so I literally was able to empty my memory card, recharge my battery, so I've got a little bit of charge left. So I'll hopefully be able to show you the World Museum in Liverpool. Also, so here's a fun fact for you guys. Did you know that there are literally more museums and art galleries um, in Liverpool than there are in any other city outside of London. Too many kids in there for me to deal with today, so I'll just film it another day, um, maybe tomorrow. The more drama, guys. I've literally just realised that I've lost my train ticket home. So now I want to show you um, the really famous bar, or the, very, the really famous club that the Beatles used to do the Beatles. The very famous club that the, the Beatles, 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 club that the Beatles used to uh, rehearse in. They have the like small content. For those who are interested, this is the Matthew Street area of Liverpool. I think it's here. Not many people really outside of the UK would know who Stella Black was because she was kind of more famous, I guess, in the UK and America. But I think she's an absolute legend. And she died, I think, two years ago now. Two years ago, she died. I'll insert a clip of Stella Black so you can see and hear her music. But yeah, she's great. I love her. Rest in peace, still love. Anyone who ever loved you know? Natasha, Natasha from Scotland. So yeah. Natasha's gonna probably say that Scottish people are the most friendly in the UK, are they? Yeah. Where about you from? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, well actually she's probably about right because Glaswegians are super friendly as well. Yeah. Little Putnians, Glaswegians, super down to earth, really cool people. You're a fan of the Beatles? Yeah. yeah. I'm not really you know. <laughs> I literally I'm I'm from the rural, which is obviously over the war and like I literally don't I don't know, I appreciate them but I'm not a fan of them. Yeah, yeah. no, I'm What's your favourite song? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Do you know the words? <laughs> <laughs> it's called a super long banana, and it's one of the symbols of Liverpool. And guess what, guys? I actually worked on painting the really small one of these when there was an exhibition here in Liverpool in 2008. So that's great information for you. So you guys, I've had the best day in Liverpool today, and I hope you've enjoyed a little. They're obviously, showing you a little tour of my city where I live, but. If we get 1,000 likes in the first 24 hours, I swear to God, I love you forever! Yeah, 1,000 likes in the first 24 hours. <laughs> so I'm going to end the vlog here because I've got things I need to do. And also, that's enough for one day. Like, what more do you want from me? How much do you love Liverpool? <laughs> on a scale of 1 to 10, how much do you love Liverpool? On a scale of 1 to 10, on a scale of 1 to 10, how much do you live Liverpool? Love Liverpool. It's great. <laughs> is, it the, is it the friendliest city in the UK? So I've it been is. there for nearly 90 years, so yeah. almost like it. Oh, so it's definitely, yeah. So we just weren't literally neighbours, that is so weird. Okay. 1929, I've lived on that. No, I didn't. I, I was born in 19. I'm gonna, I'm gonna end the vlog with these lovely people. What's your name? Eddie Davis. Eddie Davis and. Betty Davis. Eddie Davis. Betty Davis! Oh my god, it gets better! <laughs> <laughs> I'm going, you guys. I'll see you soon. Love you so much. Bye. <laughs>